All right, so a new week, a new vlog. This time I'm starting it off with the travel. This is my first flight this year. Last year I, I was flying 125 flights and uh, I'm not keen to break that record. So I actually said no to flights this year already, trying to stay more home. But yeah, couldn't avoid this one. Heading over to Sweden. So it's typically uh, the first flight of the year and a travel that should supposed to take three hours. It took me eight, nine, ten, I, I don't know. So I arrived to Stockholm and I uh, missed my uh, driver. So now I have to take a train. So I bought this Max hamburger, it's like McDonald's. It's just better. Is this called a spark on English as well? A kick. A kick. A kick. This is my first time on a kick. <laughs> I see you have uh, driven this before. I've grown up on a kick. <laughs> yeah. So straight from the airplane to the train, got picked up by Matthias, and today he's gonna probably tell me that some secrets. Some secrets. I can't tell you. <laughs> <laughs> We had some hours in these cars last year. Not one. <laughs> I'm repairing all the damage. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, these are one of the nicest rims I haven't have seen. Like, they are really cool. The intake, you still like it? Uh, it's uh, pretty decent. Pretty decent. Carbon Aventuri. Uh, Aventuri. There you go. With the nice O-set rims. With Lappi pig studs. So today I'm visiting IKEAS and doing all the final details from uh, from last year but also I'm sitting in the car that I won the third place in the FIA World Rallycross Championship last year as 2018. Good memories from this car, it's always a blast. Crazy cool season, had tons of fun. What the future will bring if I'm gonna sit in this car again I'm not sure but for sure this car after a year of driving it I have a lot of feelings for it you know. We, we went through the war it felt like in 2018. It's nice to get the chance to have a, a one last sit in it. So the steering wheel is pretty simple. We have the ALS here, which is uh, anti-lag system. We have the radio washer and the wiper. So washer is the spray, which comes up on the front window. And here is the track in um, South Africa. It's good to have all the numbers on the steering wheel. So you know, speaking on the radio, what corners you're talking about. So you can speak on the radio here and speaking about turn four or five, then you know exactly where the spotter is speaking about so you don't need to remember all the corners all the time. Gear lever, handbrake, different uh, buttons for main switches. Uh, we don't really use any of these buttons when we are driving. When it's raining we use the fans. That's basically it. This is my last time in your vlog. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. no. <laughs> I hope no. Look at this. Straight up to Instagram. Follow me. At so what are we doing? Uh, he to didn't tell me yet, but uh, this car looks fast. 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 Very fast and driving through the woods in beautiful Sweden. Look the bus. Looks fancy as always. Very fancy. <laughs>
is it cold? Minus 10. <laughs> it is actually minus 10. Heading back home to Norway. You going to Germany? I'm from Munich. 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 So back home after an awesome trip to Sweden where we got to drive the, the Skoda. The Skoda is a X Super 2000 from 2013 which is mounted a rallycross engine in it. So to drive that car it was just absolutely insane because I haven't been driving a rally since 2000, was it two years ago. All of a sudden to start listening to pace notes driving in the forest it just is a huge challenge. Driving a rally car with over 400 brake horsepower which is more than a WRC car has today it was freaking insane like that car is hilarious anyway back home gotta hit the treadmill and get the workout done for today my mom is gonna kill me because this is the messy room but the treadmill is here picture of uh, good old times from 2017 i think it is kf2 i was driving a tony cart good times <laughs> It is so damn irritating, annoying, that I don't have any progress in my running. I've tried for the last half year, maybe last year, to, to go a bit quicker. It's just so slow. I wish I was a faster runner. It's pretty hard. And uh, inside here, it's pretty warm, which is pretty good for rallycross. Because in our cars it gets like 65, 70 degrees uh, on warm days. So go in here and run in the, where you wash the clothes and stuff. Hot room with tails. It's nice to sweat a little. And it's another beautiful morning in Bergen today. New week, new possibilities. Check this out. The weather's been really, really cold lately. It's been like snowing, raining, freezing cold. It's uh, it's ice on the ground, so I couldn't drive down here today with my uh, H1. Can't get up the hill. It's uh, it's not a winter car, I can tell you that. It makes for a good drift though. So yeah, it's been a little bit frosty the last couple of days. The struggle is real. Oh, come on. I don't like smoking, but uh, today I would like me to have lighters and uh, be smoking cigarettes so I can heat up this key. The biggest problem with this car is that it's as much ice on the inside of the window as on the outside. So I woke up today with some good emails. I actually got some good news. I'll be racing soon and that's, uh, that's a good thing. That's a very good thing. I really do miss racing. Sun is shining in Bergen. Monday morning. It's a new week, new possibilities. Uh -huh. 